Hello everyone, you are welcome to how to solve this very nice algebra equation. x cubed is equal to 18 cubed plus 24 cubed plus 30 cubed. Our job is to find all possible values of x. So let's start. x cubed is equal to, this 18 cubed can be written as 6 times 3 whole cube. Plus this 24 cubed can be written as 6 times 4 whole cube plus this 30 cube can be written as 6 times 5 whole cube. Next x cubed is equal to by using this power rule a times b whole to the power n is equal to a to the power n times b to the power n. This 6 times 3 whole cubed will become 6 cubed times 3 cubed plus this 6 times 4 whole cubed will become 6 cubed times 4 cubed plus this will become 6 cubed times 5 cubed. Next x cubed is equal to from these 3 terms we can factor out 6 cubed in bracket left 3 cubed plus 4 cubed plus 5 cubed. Next, x cubed is equal to 6 cubed times this 3 cubed will become 27 plus 4 cubed will become 64 plus 5 cubed will become 125. Next, x cubed is equal to 6 cubed times this 27 plus 64 plus 125 will become 216. Next, x cubed is equal to 6 cubed times this 216 will become 6 cubed. Next, x cubed is equal to by using this power rule a to the power m times a to the power n is equal to a to the power m plus n. This is 6 cubed times 6 cubed will become 6 to the power 6. X, x cubed is equal to 6 to the power. This 6 can be written as 2 times 3. X, x cubed is equal to by using this power rule a to the power m times n is equal to a to the power m whole to the power n. This is 6 to the power 2 times 3 will become 6 squared whole to the power 3. Next, x cubed is equal to 6 squared is 36. This power 3 will come here. Now we move with this 36 cubed to the left hand side. Then this equation will become x cubed minus 36 cubed is equal to 0. And by using this algebraic identity a cubed minus b cubed is equal to a minus b times a squared plus a b plus b squared. This expression will become x minus 36 times x squared plus 36 times x plus 36 squared is equal to 0. From here either this expression x minus 36 is equal to 0 or this expression x squared plus 36 times x plus 36 squared is equal to 0. From this equation we get the value of x is equal to 36. This is the first value of x. This is the first solution of this equation. To find other two solutions, we solve this quadratic equation. This is not factorable, so we solve it by quadratic formula. According to quadratic formula, x is equal to negative 36 plus minus square root of, in place of b squared, we write 36 squared minus 4 times a is 1 times c is 36 squared divided by 2 times a is 1. 
x x is equal to negative 36 plus minus square root of from these two terms we can factor out 36 squared in bracket left 1 minus 4 divided by 2 times 1 2 and x is equal to negative 36 plus minus square root of 36 squared 36 squared times this 1 minus 4 will become negative 3 divided by 2 and x is equal to negative 36 plus minus this expression can be written as a square root of 36 squared times square root of 3 times square root of negative 1 divided by 2. Next, x is equal to negative 36 plus minus this square will be cancelled out with this square root and here we are left with 36 times this square root of 3 this square root of negative 1 will become i divided by 2 now from the numerator we can factor out 2 so this will become x is equal to 2 as common factor in bracket left negative 18 plus minus 18 times root 3 i divided by 2 now this 2 will be cancelled out with this 2 and from here we get uh, two values of x x2 is equal to negative 18 plus uh, 18 times uh, root 3i x3 is equal to negative 18 minus 18 times uh, root 3i and first we found the value of x1 is equal to 36 First, we found the value of x1, 36. So, we have uh, three solutions of uh, this equation.